drama at the Pacific Science Center today as an unidentified man scaled Seattle's iconic Space Needle and attached an enormous banner to its spire. And while the meaning of the flag symbol and the identity of the banner man both remain mysteries, what is clear is that Seattle's bioterrorist population... Banner man. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Yeah, I just heard. And can we please not use the B word? What? A bioterror? Yeah. You know, that's just a slur invented by the DUP to make people scared of conduits, man. Look, whatever you want to call him, let's just track him down and find out what he can tell us about Augustine. And drain his powers. Okay, fine. And drain his powers. I'm telling you, it's gonna work. All right. They just found a body in Fifth and Briar. Go check it out. But promise me, you'll be inconspicuous? Yeah. It tickles. I got it, I got it. I'll put my phasers on stun. Okay, I did it your way. I'm past your boys in blue. Thank you. Although, what's the use of having smoke powers if you're not gonna use them? Ah, there's my baby brother. Well, found the victim. Definitely the work of a conduit. It's very... showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. There's your wounds. I wonder what kind of power did this? Fire blast or lasers? Ooh, what about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well, you know what? If it does, my first victim, it's gonna be the guy who came up with the name Bannerman. Bro, you really need to let that go. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out. There's going to be a lot of DUP there. DUP with shoot-to-kill orders. Wow. Well, hate to interrupt this little pep talk, but... Got any luck with that first victim on your face database thing? No, nothing. Must not have had a record. Huh. From the looks of the guy, I at least would have expected a drug bust or two. No, 
Let's get the conduit! Jeez, and good luck with that. Well, this conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, I just need... <sighs> Let me guess, face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble.
All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. I got a hit on the face. Guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. Might give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Holy sh Holy what? What holy? Delson, are you okay? Yeah. Found our sniper. Wait, 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 wait. don't be impale me. I come in peace. <laughs> Hey, it's okay, I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not gonna hurt you. God, especially if you don't slow down. Meeting you. you get him? No, he ran fast, like, like really, really fast, conduit fast, man. Screw flesh eating death gaze. I want that. Oh, don't be greedy. Funny thing, man. I just before every shot, you could see the neon sign behind him dim a little. Uh, must be his power source. Uh, head back to the sign. See what you can find. You should see what this guy can do, man. Like, lasers or something. I'm telling you, it would be great to have a one-two punch like that and smoke when I get to Augustine. Take it easy. We've got to find him again first. All right, I'm here. Any idea what I should be looking for? Just anything that might help with who our sniper well, is. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? You should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What, what does that even mean? I, I don't know, it's just girled up, girl stuff. Like the name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting and it is Definitely the best smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay, uh, look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. Okay, those definitely very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. Okay. See how you might think those are women's shoes? Yeah, they're like size negative. Like, seriously? A serial killer who reads Jane Eyre? Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, we'll get lucky. You know, if I had smoke and lasers, I could, like, put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was, uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop, okay? Seriously, just stop. 
Okay, I'm thinking when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, whoom, smoke. And then once I got on the ropes, it's like zap, zap. I'll whip out the laser show. Well, it's good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. Name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this, found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death, a single puncture wound of unknown origin through the chest. I'm sending you the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. Sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah? Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That'd sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying what? The DUP is trying to scare people? I mean, their job is to control the panic. Hey, I was trying to do my duty as a citizen, man, but they were trying to do their duty as criminals. Alright, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in Fred, progress. So now you do want me killing people with my powers? I didn't say kill them, just... Yeah, well, don't forget she's a murderer, right? Pretty damn good one, too. You gotta admit, girl makes a mean vortex. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day, while she chowders down. You know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I am on my way. Off the streets, unless we stop this prison. More about you to turn out like Fetch Walker. Fetch Walker? Her body was corrupted by drugs, and the drugs turned her into a bioterrorist. We need your help to keep our streets clean of that kind of filth. Filth, huh? Hey, you're either fighting with us or against us. What's the name of that book? You know, the one that says, uh, let he who is without sin cast the first stone? Radical. Wow, I'm impressed with your impulse control. Um, but maybe you should wait up by the neon sign, yeah? Might be less conspicuous that way. Besides, she'll probably head there to recharge. Yeah, plus there's probably less people I want to kick the crap out of up there. That too. It, it was the Bible. By the way, what I was quoting, it was the Bible, if you were, if you were wondering. I wasn't. Hey, 
Delson. Neon sign? Huh? Big glowy thing? I was taking the scenic route. Okay, just need a place to hide. Okay, this is good. Surveillance. Hobo style. Oh man, that smells good. Why didn't I take some cash off those dealers? Money, why do you hate me? Be my friend, Money. Come to me. Let's bond. No! It's okay! God! Ah, not this again. Just like last time, Delson. Concentrate. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not getting away. I got this now. Just leave me alone! Run up walls? <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. what I came to do!
Dude. Yeah, lady, you've got to calm down, all right? Relax. You're not taking Just me wanna... back! I am not going back to Curtin K! Good news is, less juice for her. Bad news, I'm not a night person. Huh? Maybe stop trying to kill me, and we can let the beer signs live to see another day. That was awesome. Augustine. You're one of a goddamn robot. How many times? Wait, are there really? I just want some of your powers. That's all. Just leave me alone. even tickle. Come on, Powers, I know you're in there. Surprise me. No! Oh, I'm so gonna use this! I am not going back! You can run, but you can't hide. Where the hell are you? <sighs> Clever girl.
As a little girl, I never thought it'd be me. That I'd be one of them. My powers were a surprise. My parents turned me in. They knew what the government would do to people like me, and they did it anyway. I didn't know what to do, but... My brother Brent just grabbed our coats, and we ran. Those were hard days on the street. Moving from city to city, no comfort anywhere. Until we met some dealers, and man, they hooked us up. The drugs. The drugs were heaven. But then we always wanted more. And the withdrawal, agony. Always looking for a fix. And when you lose your stash, when you think someone stole it from you, the drugs, the dealers, they make you do things they... The government picked me up easy enough after that. But it wasn't a regular jail. They trained me to shoot, taught me how to kill. So on the day of the crash, I escaped with all those skills. Everything I needed to set things right. Brent, I promise. Every dealer I find, I'm gonna burn your name in their chest. No one else is gonna suffer like we did. No brother. Nobody else. <laughs> Delson. Delson, you all right, brother? What happened? Oh, she did good. You did good, buddy. Come on, get up. Get up. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> You did good. I know just where to put filth like this. Somewhere where Augustine won't find her, and she won't be hurting anybody else. Hey, no, 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 no. She's just killing drug dealers, man. Killing? Nelson, murdering drug dealers. What do you think I'm doing to the DUP? What you have to to save the Akomish back home. She stays free. No. Dude, no way. Look, just because you have the same affliction, not gift, affliction. Doesn't mean that we're gonna pick up every little piece of trash we find. Look, I'm never going to abandon you, all right? Not ever. This one goes in a cage. Hey! It should be my responsibility. Yeah, because responsibility is not exactly something you excel at. I got this. Fine. I'm here for the tribe, not the Holland bioterrorists. I'm a conduit. He's cool. He's normally cool. He's just not today. Yeah. Let's talk. Red, sorry, I... Oh, look who it is. What, is the meeting of the Conduit Club finally over? 
I just wanted to talk to her, okay? To see if maybe she could help us out. Oh, you are not doing the pouting Reggie thing, are you? You know I hate that! But you know someone like that shouldn't be free to roam the streets. Uh, are you forgetting who else is someone like that? Not the same. You're different. Yes, I know. I'm your brother. And your brother is asking for your help and trying to stay alive. If you won't do it for me, then do it for the tribe. Fine. Yeah. What do you need? Thank you. I need to see what else this new power can do, and you are my go-to guy when it comes to finding the core relays. There, I sent it. For the tribe and you. Thank you. I'll let you know what I get. No, I don't want to know what you get. Bye, pouting Reggie. Hey, Fetch, you know those glowing boxes the Dukes put up all over town? Yeah, I see. What? Well, I think I figured out a way to use them to, like, tap into more powers for me. I was gonna try it out on the new neon power you gave me. Gave you? And I thought maybe you'd like to tag along, you know, maybe talk me through the new stuff. I already bagged my dealer limit for the day, so why the hell not? And there's my sweet girl. Screw you. Okay, there's supposed to be one of those things at, uh, second in Maine. Yeah, I've seen it before. Meet you there. Hey, Fetch, it's over here. Yeah, I'm cool. None of its trackers and me don't get along. You're on your own, V. Hey, uh, you guys seen a girl kind of short? No mercy. Shoot to kill. No, I think they were just on patrol. Well, I found another one. I left you signs to find it. See it? It's a neon marker. Uh, yeah, got it. Just follow those. Fetch, just stumbled across a bit of your handiwork. Think maybe you want to dial it down a notch? Gotta feed the fury, dude. <laughs> or maybe you don't feed the fury. It'll starve to death and you become a people person. Like me. Or, or maybe you can bite me. Garbage! It's what you deserve! Hey, Smokes! You want in on this? Yeah, yeah, you still need help? Don't need it, but I'll take it. You got this. I'll go find another one of those things. Yeah! We should tone it down with the dealers. You going soft on me, D? Hey, 
we have powers they don't means we have to be the better people, you know? Cut them a little slack now and then. Just think about it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just go get yourself some more powers. Hey, there it is. Go ahead and get your convulsion on. You first. You know, anytime you want to actually hang around for one of these things... I've been thinking about what you said before, about the drug dealers on the street. Oh, yeah? The way I see it, going after those ass gum dealers is just small time. But going up the food chain a little, finding the supplier, that'll change things. 